All right, welcome to episode ten. <coughs> excuse me of that. <coughs> excuse me <laughs> of the Half Moon Bay region. Um, we've got our inner, our inside the city freeway going here, as well as our outside. You know, from outside the city and to just go straight through, uh, because this is going to be kind of a throughput area. I think we're going to do like a really big commercial thing down here. I'm not really sure yet, um, but we'll we'll figure it out as we go. And we've got our train coming in here. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna take a sip of some, well, coffee here. But we'll see if that helps. Okay, much better. Now, at the end of the last video, and sorry about the sound problems of the last video, I was having such bad allergies. I, I had to mute the, the microphone every time I had to sneeze, which was a lot. And I must have forgotten to turn it back on at some point. So, I, I've been thinking about this, however, and I'm thinking that we have one side... One side can be an entrance here possibly for this way I don't know this see this is the hard part is where do I put these roads oh since we have this shortened up let's put these in too so I know where I can put them we can even scoot that back a little from the main spot there And I guess we could do, like, two entrances. One on either side. Do something kind of coming around the, the edge of the city this way. Let's try that here. So let's see. On this side, we need to come this way. It's going to be a long way, though. So I don't want... <coughs> excuse me again. Jeez. I don't want the... Uh, you know what? Maybe we'll, maybe we'll do this. We'll curve the actual road. Um, if I can remember where they are anymore. I mean, it's awesome to have the unidirectional road network, but man, this, there's a lot of freaking roads in my menus now. <laughs> Okay, let's figure out this side first. Yeah, and, and plus the regional waterway stuff is in there too. So maybe we can do something like this and kind of make a shallow-ish curve. Like here. Uh, I'm going to have to take that out. That could work. And then we can have entrance and exit over here. Okay. So first, let's take this out. And we are going to want this side to be coming in. And this side to be going out. So these are for people coming in the city, like this way. Uh, curved road. Let's see, can we go uh, too sharp? Something like this would be ideal.
There we go. And then we can have an exit that goes... this way. It's, it's not a great intersection. I mean, it's really weird, but I guess it'll work. <clears throat> hmm. I wonder if I can get this to come in in a little bit. You know what, though? Let's actually let's actually take this out and let's make it the two lane one, because this is really two lanes. I think that'll help it to not look as weird, too. Come on. There we go. Uh, that's going to be too far. I want this to look good, too. <laughs> so sorry if I'm being a little bit picky. Uh, whoops. Freeway ramp. Curve went. Uh, ramp. That's a little better. There. I mean, again, it's still not a great intersection, but... It works. And I do expect this to be rather high traffic because it's a school thing, so... I'm thoroughly okay with using... Come on. There you go. With using the two-lane ones. All right. Now we just need to have this one hook up to the other side. So I think what we're going to do here... <coughs> let's see, we don't need this one. We will need one that comes over here. Something like, let's see here. Something like this. Come on. Should work. And then we can go. Oh, why did I do one lane? I thought we're, I forgot we're doing two lane with this. Uh, elevated. There we go. So let's see. We want to come from somewhere right about here go almost straight when we get over here.
And then transition. That actually looks pretty smooth. I'll take it. And then we connect. Transition ramp. This one is the one that needs to kind of come out at an angle. I don't know if I can do it though. There's not a, an intersection there. Then we're also going to need one along the ground. Oh, really? It's too close? Damn. All right. Okay, let's do <laughs> I should have drawn that in first. I knew there was going to have to be one going that way. Or wait. No, it needs to come in. Yeah, because there's an in and an out. And this one, that's an out. And this needs to be an in. <coughs> Man. Keeping this all straight is kind of hard sometimes. <laughs> Then we want to do this sort of thing. Oh, except with a curved road. And I don't want an intersection created. Grabbing on to stuff. There we go. Just give me the angle that I'm looking for. There. Thank you. Is that so much to ask? <laughs> Jesus. I just realized I connected everything to the wrong sides of the road. I'm a moron. All that work and <laughs> it's connected to the wrong side. Let's figure out how they're going to come in from this way first. Two lane ramp. I'm pretty sure maybe I should actually make a curve. Make it come like right across here. No. Is 
something like this. There we go. And then can we get down to ground level? Pretty easily, actually. And again, you drew this going the wrong direction. Man, I really gotta <laughs> pay attention to this. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. And then we need two lane ramp. Gotta make sure it looks good. Really? Why are we not? Okay. Are we not at ground at the right level there? Oh, wrong thing. Elevated. Should be at the right level. Let's see if this works here. There we go. That looks good. Then we need to connect these. Excuse me, two lane ground to elevated transition. That works. In fact, we can back it up one to then connect the ground one. Uh, we need the two lane ground one. Oh, wait. Ah, that's right. I forgot I have to have these. Okay, let's take this out real quick. Because this actually needs to connect in here. So they have to cross at a point. And I'm 
trying to figure out where I should cross them. Okay, let's first do this one. Yeah, I see they're going to cross. I actually cross there. Um, okay. What if we do a raised one? Oops. Okay, so you don't like that road grade, do you? What if we start it from back here farther? lane. Oops. Let me get it all the way up to like here. And then we take this transition and go like underneath here somehow. Really? I can't do it and turn towards this? I keep grabbing the wrong one. Oh, I see it's trying to do that. Can we go under this at all? Hmm. I must be starting too close. And I don't know if that will grab onto the right thing. Not quite. Um. I don't think we can make it across the road like this. No. Yeah, that's... Oh, and it's still even grabbing onto the road. Yay! Then elevated, okay. Okay, now hopefully there's enough room between these two for me to make it down to the ground. is, but not as close as I would like, so maybe I'll have to start over here. Okay. Now we at least got over there. Now all we have to do is get this to come in and look nice. Um, we don't need the ramp though, or the transition, we just need this.
There we go. So this needs to come back one. We should be able to make... Change that curve just a little bit. Hey, ProLogix, good to see you in the chat there. Ooh, a little bit outside. See, that's... Alright, I gotta watch that. There we go. It's not going to give me a nice intersection. Well, it's not terrible. <coughs> but it works. And I believe this... I can probably straighten out from... from like here... to there. Make it just a, a little bit cleaner looking. Like that. So then you can come off here and go in here. You can come off here and go in here. Or if you're coming this way, you go in here or you come off here. So from either side of the road, you can get to and from the university. Cool. And we have some more space over here that we can build university stuff. Um, you know, m more add-ons and whatever else we want to put over here. <coughs> now we also need to find a place for the, um, the solar uh, power station. Hello, mini dude. Good to see you. Just so you guys know, I'll probably record uh, like two episodes back to back here. So if you're just joining, you know, stick around after this episode. We're only about halfway through, and uh, and I'll probably do another one. Hey, hey, Z Man Wallace. Did everybody just like wake up or? <laughs> no, it was around for a little while. I am pretty good, mini dude. How about yourself? Um, let's see. Power is going to need to go up here. Or not need to, but this is, this is kind of where I want it. Oh, I could just squeeze it in right there. That would be kind of cool. Because, yeah, that's the other part. Pro sort of problem is I need to put roads down over here. Mm. I don't know. I kind of like it. <laughs> well, sorry, Mini Dude. Uh, you know, most of them I put up on YouTube, though, for people like yourself who get busy, because I have the same problem. I get busy, too. I have... Well, I wouldn't call it a life, but I, I am alive, so I, <laughs> I have to do things sometimes. <laughs> but, uh... Oh, let's see here. The other thing I was thinking about, and I guess I kind of ruined it now. Yeah, uh, I was thinking about, I have this this kind of spot over here. Can't find me on YouTube? Oh. 
I'll put it in chat here. Just a second here. Type it in chat. Should work. Yeah. Takes you right to my my page. Well, thank you, ProLogix. I, I've been working really hard on the freeway. W what do you guys think about this intersection that I did right here? Um, it's not really an intersection, but to get to the... It's kind of a, it's very specific to the, the university, because I want, want people to get there. I don't know. What do you guys think? Well, um, let me know. The other thing... Okay, so yeah. Th this is what I need to figure out now. Is... <clears throat> power station. So let's do this. I think I might actually m give it its own little entrance and exit. But I don't know that it needs it. <laughs> well, thank you, mini dude. And thanks for logics. I'm I'm glad you guys are liking these intersections cuz they're a little bit of a little bit painstaking to do, but they they do come out looking pretty good, and they function really, really well. So, um, and I needed to, to figure out what to do with this area. Maybe I'll make that a commercial district in here. Because the other thing I need to do is, yeah, let's 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 do some zones in this area. Let's figure out where we're gonna have stuff. So, let's keep spacing for one of these. One lane. Give me guides. There we go. Oh, we need to uh, turn off the guides. Give me the guides. Just want this one. Just want to make sure we keep the, the spacing there so that I can do some entrances and exits as needed. Then, uh, this. Now I don't want guides. And we should do, uh, I don't know. So, um, the, the feel or theme or whatever you want to call it that I'm kind of going for for this city is industrial concrete jungle. So that's why I don't mind using up a lot of roads. Um, well, Mini Dude, I would play more often, but I don't really play online anymore. I, I like all the offline mods, so I tend to play just offline only almost. Um, but if I ever do play online, uh, then definitely. Um, let's do, let's do the road right here, like almost right up against it. Uh, how am I going to connect these though? Okay, here, here's what I'll do for the, this will be just for the power area. Or the power station, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> well, thanks, Mini Dude. It's uh, I I would love to play with other people, but to me, the experience online is subpar. Um, there, there's a lot they could have done to make it nice, and they didn't. So, hopefully, you know, if if that were different, if they ever make that better or anything, I'd be more inclined to play online with other people. Um, yeah. It's nothing against you, man. It's mostly the game. And partially because some a lot of the mods I use are, are offline only. Like 
curve out of this corner. Yeah, but for instance, this uh, freeway mod or the one-way road mod, whatever you want to call it, Udon, offline only. You know, subway, uh, the the maglev, the subway maglev one, offline only. The L train one that you can now connect into that, offline only. So. <laughs> So let's see, this one it can just connect in here, and this one can go over the top over here. Okay, this will actually be fairly heat, fairly simple. Oh, really, Mini Dude? Because, I mean, they're, they're marked as offline only, so I kind of assumed they were, you know... Uh, offline only, <laughs> you know. Uh, raised. That'll work. Oh, come on. Seriously? You're going to snap onto there and then draw from that road. I was under the the understanding, Mini Dude, that if you use them online, your city could be rolled back. But I may have been mistaken in that. I, that's just what I understood from, you know, the the way that mods worked. Let's try to get it just right in the middle here. Hey, there we go. And we can slope in. Go back one more. Is the space station still broken? That's no, I haven't tried to build one since the last time I did, because it was freaking broken. Ugh, that's so tedious. I can't believe they haven't fixed that. That doesn't... Yeah, there we go. Well, it's a little bit of a messed up intersection, but I will live with it because it's SimCity and I know that these things happen.
Yeah, I mean, really, ProLogix, I agree. The, the basis is there for SimCity. They just got to fix these little things. And little, yeah, exactly, Mini Dude. It's, it's tiny things that need to be straightened out. You know, some of the road intersections, if they would connect in a, in a decent manner, you know, they had decent uh, textures for them, it'd be way better. And, and it would take, you know, a designer, you know, a couple days to make some new textures. It's not like a huge waste of, you know, use of time or anything. Uh, I don't have TeamSpeak, Mini Dude, uh, but I, I don't do, um, I, I don't have uh, other people when I do uh, episode streaming. When I do just, like, R&D and stuff, you know, like, that's not an episode, then, I, then I'll then i definitely have other people on if they want to be on, but, um, during episodes, I, I don't do that. <laughs> I know, sorry. I'm I'm a spoil sport. Then let's put the power in. Like this. Maybe that's not the right pattern to use. Ah. Do I see the chat on YouTube? Yes, I do put the chat on YouTube. It's uh, cause it it's just directly taken from the stream on um Twitch. Okay, so our power station is in. Back in two seconds, I just need to go grab a beverage here. <coughs> All right. Now let's do some zoning what is what is your challenge there mini dude I think what I want to do is have kind of a main avenue come in here I won't be able to go under there though Maybe I should have the avenue go this way. I don't know. I'm trying to think here because I want to do something with these where they can go either direction. Okay, what if we do the avenue this way? Um, high density, straight line. What if we do it like this? <laughs> or or maybe closer even to here? And then at this point, we turn it up, do something like this, and make like a long corner out of this. Oh, 
You know, Mini Dude, I that's what I was attempting to do with, um, uh, or really, I, I did accomplish it with the um, what was my other one? The other region that I did recently, the Midway. And I, I pretty much did accomplish that with Midway, but there was only three uh, spots. There wasn't a force. It wasn't a four. Four great work region. And then we back this off to like here. And we use. Where is the. Where's the part that I want? Two lane ramp. We use this to do, let's see, come out this way. And then Oh, that's not going to work at all, is it? At least not the way that I wanted it to. Oh, wait, this has to come in anyway. Yeah, that's going to look terrible either way that I do it. So that's a pretty tough challenge. I'd have to start a new series for that um, mini dude, but it's definitely something I will think about for another series. Come on. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to do this the other way that actually makes decent connections with this, which is with the one-way high-density streets. That's even, it's not a great intersection, but it's better, I guess. You know, really, I don't know if this is the right thing to do here. I think what the right thing to do is is do it with a high density street. And just have it come down to here. And come up from here. Mm, that's actually a little close. <laughs> I keep I can't find the right spot for this. Sorry, it's just taking me a minute. There, now does that have enough room? Probably. No, probably not. That should have enough room though.
There we go. And then we make entrances and exits off of this. And let's get one of these in place. along there. Now since these are two lane roads, we'll just do like we did before and we'll do the two lanes in. <laughs> Thanks for logic. I think, I, I don't know if unique is, uh, <coughs> I, you know, I'll take it as a compliment. <laughs> Let's see, let's have this one kind of come in this way. And then, I don't want guides. And then this is going to kind of be like this. Again, not totally beautiful intersection, but decent. Fix this one. Uh, da, 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 two lane. There we go. And then, so this is going to be to go left. We need the one lane. this to come out at a better angle than it's wanting to. There we go. And then this one will be the right hand turn when we connect it in. And this one goes straight in to there. And then we should have one like that. Now this is just going to go here, so let's figure that out real quick, because that'll be easy. that big of a curve. Maybe do three. Yeah, that, that looks a lot better. And I don't want it to bend the road. There we go. This one is going to do the same thing, but going the other way. I'm 
try to give it about the same distance. <coughs> There we go. Now the hard part, because these two have to cross. Because this one needs to go this way, and this one needs to go this way. And I'm not sure which one we have a longer distance on, but I think we'll do this one as the higher one. So let's do this one first. So this one's going to need to go, uh, maybe actually even from up here. To right there. Hey, Stermovic, good to see you. Oh, see, that's that's coming in at too sharp of an angle. That's a good angle. And then we can have it go down that whole distance. Okay. We do the same with this. Uh, whoops, transition. A little sharp, but that should work. Now for the tall one. Uh, let's give ourselves just a little bit more room over here. Well, that actually came in pretty good. And we'll get it back to regular level. And then back to ground level. Where we'll have to connect it right in, I think. See, that's real sharp, though. Yeah, that's a little better. sure why it doesn't seem to want to connect into any of this very nicely. I guess that'll have to work. It's not too messed up. Now, this trick is going to be harder. Because I think I need this much space Well, maybe I can just do that's too close. Uh, 
And I'm pretty sure that this is too close to actually make this work. So we're going to have to move this back just a little bit. Snap onto this one. Really? Ugh. Always with the road, Stimovic. <laughs> There we go. And that actually looks pretty good, I think. Then we just have to connect these sides in. Actually, I don't like. There we go. And why does it want to mess with the entrance like that? Then we'll connect this one in, and that'll all be connected. So apart from some annoyingly glitchy road textures, which are fairly standard in SimCity, this is all hooked up. And it looks like we're right about the end of this episode. So we'll start putting in our areas for zones in the next one. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. As usual, you can follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash tinvec to see what I'm doing live. Or you can uh, subscribe to my channel on YouTube. It's youtube.com slash tinvec. Um, just see, you know, what I put up after the fact. I also have a website, tinvec.com. Put some stuff up there sometimes. There's always, uh, you know, episodes listed there as well. So, thanks for watching. And uh, if you're watching live on the stream, I will be back in just a moment uh, to start episode 11.